Right, moment of truth. <laughs> if I've measured this wrong, this has been an Italian waste of time. The woman in B&Q said, oh, go to this guy. He has a treasure trove of loads of stuff that nobody buys. Right, we are in one of the motorhomes. Nick's just about to open a bottle of Prosecco. Good morning guys, welcome to a new vlog. Um, we have some chores to run this morning. Depending on what time we get finished, we may well go back to the lodge today. Um, then we're gonna go to your mum's for lunch, aren't we? Half past nine in the morning, it's 19 degrees. Is it, is it? Yeah. Oh, it feels hotter than that. So apparently it's gonna be about 27 degrees this weekend. So uh, Lee's brought the sun cream out with us because it'll no doubt end up sitting in the garden drinking gins. Mm -hmm. I feel like we live at Wicks at the moment. Me a lockdown, don't you? We're just coming to get some screws and stuff to help um, my dad with a fence panel that is broken. Oh, this is post. Post, yeah. So uh, we're here and I might help my sister with a bit of gardening if she's she was gardening yesterday. So uh, I might get some gardening gloves because she's got a few weeds that need taking up. They're cheaper than I thought. £2.50 for gardening gloves at Wicks. Get a pair of those. It's now 3.38 in the afternoon and we've finished all our jobs. Um, so we're treating ourselves to a McFlurry, a mini one. Belgian milk chocolate, I think I'd go for. What about you? Oh. I don't like the whipped cream, it puts me off. So I'm having a McFlurry instead. Oh, I've ordered a Maltese McFlurry and now I've seen the tiramisu one and I fancy one of them instead. I know, but it'll just taste like a fake, a fake Bailey's taste. It'll not be like a real tiramisu. It's 24 degrees, so mm. we're treating ourselves to a, a mini McFlurry. Bliss. I fixed Lee's dad's fence with a, um, a, um, a metal bracket, didn't I? I was going to use a piece of wood, but I used a metal bracket. And yep. uh, Lee was taking the mickey out of me because I was out, outside, basically, with my top off. And he said I looked like I was going into a field like a farmer. Actually, what I said, you look like Flubber the Flump. No, he didn't. <laughs> Which so, I do. Anyway, added a bit of weed in. And um, now we're treating ourselves to a mini McFlurry, Malteser. Too many Maltese? Too many. There you go, mate. Ooh. Thank you. Ooh. Cheers, thank you. Ooh. Um, um. You would think by now, in this day and age, that McDonald's would find a way to make McFlurries without having to use this ridiculous little big plastic spoon in every one of them. Mm. Not very environmentally friendly, is it? No. But. That, that spoon is actually the bit that stirs it yeah. in the machine. It clips on and then they do the stuff. Bad show at McDonald's. Is it nice though? Delicious. Oh, I needed that coffee. Just currently uh, making some food. We have fish and chips in the oven, peas in the microwave, and um, Nick is making lots of noises around here. Can I get a paintbrush to paint that? Well, oh, okay, the frame. Mm -hmm. So if you didn't see it in the last vlog, this is the frame. I think we did it earlier in this vlog. No, we didn't actually. It's the um, frame that Nick is building to go over the windows in the bedroom at the lodge so that we can have the windows open fully on an evening right, in the eating. summer without, um, what do you call it? It's coming through spiders. Spiders, flies. So this is the, um, again, we showed you on the last vlog. That's the mesh we got from Amazon. That's gonna go um, in it. So it looks a bit dark there, but it won't because it's folded over quite a lot, off quite a bit there. Oh, so you're gonna paint it now? Yeah, might as well. It's 24 degrees outside. Let's go and enjoy the balcony. Yeah, well, it'll dry quicker, won't it? Right, so my plans for doing the painting. Get rid of the fire alarm going off. I failed because we gave Lee's mum and dad our remaining Venetian grey paint samples for when they did their kitchen. We still haven't got it back. So I have no paint here other than a dried tub. Where's the, where's the dried tub? Eh? What? Where's the dried tub? A paint. No idea. Other than a dried tub of Venetian grey. So we have no paint. So I have to use the um, the proper stuff that matches the lodge exactly when we get back to the lodge well, tomorrow. Well, just to relax because we've been busy all day long. It's about Ooh, seven. them chips look nice. This is what I had oh, for tea. Wait a minute. That reminds me. Get out, wait. Fish and chips. Them fish look small. Come oh, on. I want the hot pepper sauce out of the fridge as well. That reminds me, I missed the air fryer when we were at the apartment, so I'm going to look on one. I'm going to look for one. Absolutely no need to do that. Why? Because we're never here. We've just been here for a whole week. And I, everything that I've, that we I've done... We've takeaways every night! Everything that I've done so far, I could have done in the air fryer, apart from the peas that are in the microwave. It's not worth getting an air fryer for two meals. I'll be getting one, don't you worry. What are you doing? I'm covering it up because it doesn't look very nice because I've covered it in brown it looks stuff. Looks like you've shat on it. <laughs> brown some pickle, the smooth one, and HP sauce. And en enough peas to open a pea factory. 
I've got hot sauce, and we're just going to watch something now on Netflix. What are we going to watch? Voyager. As I thought would happen, as happened, Lee was sat outside on the balcony, it was a little bit chilly, and I got a WhatsApp, I was laying on the bed, naked, almost, because it was so hot, I was just laying in my pants. <coughs> and he texts me and says, shall we go back to the lodge? And I'm like, it's up to you. So, here we are. Ten minutes so, later, we're in the car. We've got the, uh, the window screen, literally, sprawl through the car. Uh, we're on the motorway, we are going to be there at about half past eight. I just keep thinking about snacks we've got a lodge. More than we've got an apartment, that's for sure. Yeah. 15 minutes to go. It's been one hour, 45 minutes since the last update. I am so bored and Lee refuses to let me drive because he would have to sit with this frame wrapped around us. I'm just happy so listening to... So um, therefore, today, yeah. he's volunteered to drive, yeah. usually won't. I'm happy listening to the greatest hits of Kyle Minogue. Except, every time he puts a song on, 30 seconds into it, he changes it, like he's like sk skipping and scanning tracks. I just like to put So it's driving me insane, and I'm absolutely starving. And when we get into the lodge, I've just checked the temperature on Hive, 29.3 degrees Celsius, which is basically friggin', I'm just going to work it out in Fahrenheit, but I can't, but it's ba basically extremely hot. It's actually hotter than the apartment, and um, one of the reasons why we wanted to come back tonight was so we didn't have to bear the heat in the apartment. Think, think, I should get, think I should get this fitted quickly. Well, maybe. <laughs> right, moment of truth. <laughs> if I've measured this wrong, this has been an entire waste of time. That needs uh, sorting out. Let's see. We already have millions of spiders. I'm just going to say, let's hope there's no more spiders because we haven't slept in it since that last yeah. one, I don't think. Hold on. What? Is he in one? No. Oh. He's moving stuff off a of bed. Come on, let's have a look. Let's have a look. Oh, I'm gonna get up there. Wait a minute. Come on. Man. Let's see. Let's see if I measured it right. Oh yes, it looks like it. Does it fit? Wait a minute, a bit higher. Yeah. Perfect. <laughs> Perfect. Thank God for that. So if that locks on there, I just need how much space have you got at your end? Uh, it's it's it bang flush? on. Exactly bang on. Mine's flush and all. What about can top can you see all those spiders webs and spiders out there? I'm not sure you can on the camera. That's the reasons why we can't Ooh. keep this open. It's got a bell on, but I have got some thoughts on how I can... So that's Nick's task tomorrow, this. isn't it? Yeah, we're going to paint first. and put mesh on. And uh, then tomorrow night, we're going to sleep with the windows open. It'll look, it will match, because I've got this colour paint yep. in the cupboard. Yep. It will match this exact. I just need to find some way of... Well, I've got three hinges to clip this onto the top of that, which should take the weight, and then I just need to find some way of, of like sealing it here. I'm thinking maybe I'll get like L hooks. You know that This is very interesting, but more importantly, to lock it in. do we want some toast? Yeah. I knew you won't be able to wait. Well, if I don't do it, if I don't do it now, I've got to wait then tomorrow for it to dry, aren't I? So I might as well let it dry overnight. It That's my theory. It looks perfect. I'm just uh, having a cup of tea and watching um, Maxine and Baza. You have to think about it there. Well, I, would, I, I don't know why. <laughs> <laughs> I was going to say theme park Baza, but then I said Maxine and Baza. So I'm watching the Bazas. They're live, or they were live while we've been driving over. Um, so. Can you do me a favour? Yeah. Get me some. Um, now this is stabilised, I need to pull these staples out. Can you get me pliers, please? Okay. Good morning, guys. Welcome to the next day. Very exciting news in the lodge this morning. I'm tired. I was up, just about to start. Um, I was up at seven o'clock in the morning painting the frame that we showed you in, earlier on in the vlog, and I've actually fitted it to the window, so I'm going to show you it now. So, there we go. It's actually installed. You're probably thinking, we well, can't tell. Um, so basically, the hinges are on, but I've not got the catchings yet, but that's where the mesh is going to go on the back of that. I'm going to get some L, L hooks from B&Q when we go into town just so I can secure it on the corner, like twisty ones that bend over. Um, we're going to staple the mesh on, then I've just got some touch-ups to do. And um, tonight will be the night that we actually test it, hopefully, as long as I can get the L-hooks that... Um, just turn this fan off. Uh, tonight will be the night that we actually test it with the window open full, because last night was unbelievably hot, um, that we can have the window open without any spiders crawling over his faces. So I'm well pleased with that. The colour match is pretty much exact. Um, the seal on it's pretty good, no spiders can get through that. 
I just need three L hooks for the bottom and then I've got a secure hinge at the top which needs a bit of a spacer in it because the, the wood's warped on the existing frame. Um, but you can't really see the hit. Shut up! But you can't really see the hinges at the top. So I'm extremely pleased with that. And Lee's, Lee's usually skeptical until he sees the end result and he's basically can't wait to sleep with the window open tonight. It's only took five years of having this. It's supposed to be like 30 degrees or something today. Then the sooner we get to BQ and get the L hooks, the sooner I can fit it and then you can have the windows on all day. We want to go to Morrison's and all, we haven't got any food. We also need to go and um, find a motorhome and measure some beds to see what bedding we need. Days like this is why we got James, even though the sun's just got in. <laughs> just as you started the camera. It's a, there's a heat wave this week, um, so obviously we'll be using James every time we go out. Roof down, hats on, blah blah blah. James is just as runabout car, it's not as serious no. car. And we forgot to bring a tape measure out, so if we can find a um, motorhome locally, we can't measure, so we're going to have to buy a tape measure from B&Q when we go and get Nick's hooks. I know where there's a place that sells them, so we're going to try there. Yeah, so B&Q, Mori Bob's for some food, hopefully find a measurement uh, at a camper van. And then next week we have to either go and buy the bedding for the camper van or measure the size of the bedding that we've already got and see whether it'll work. My mum suggested just taking um, sleeping bags, which I thought were a good idea because you don't have to bother with a bed in there. It's too much like camping. But Nick doesn't like the camping idea of, of sleeping bags, but I think it's a much better idea. Anyway, uh, take us to where we're going. I'm not sold on it. Sky, I remember thinking if I only could stop the time Way back when we didn't care what they said £2.47 is the cheapest um, tape measure I can get. That's what I need, but I need it in silver. Do you need, you want one of these? Since you've got not, not got one at the lodge. Yes, go on then. Absolutely amazed. You're amazed? I'm amazed. The woman in B&Q said, oh, go to this guy. He has a treasure trove of loads of stuff that nobody buys. And lo and behold, he has what I want. They're in, different colour. They're in brass, but I'll put them underneath so you won't see them. Perfect. Right, Morrison's down. Come on then. Right, we are in one of the motorhomes um, that is going to be like the one that we are hiring. Not and this one though. Not this, this one. Like this is a pet friendly one. So this is going to be my sister's bed, probably there, all the girls. And then there's a double bed up here, which is measuring. And then at the back is another bigger than double bed, which is where we're going to be um, sleeping. This is going to be our um, kitchen area, full oven and uh, kitchen, uh, sorry, fridge and uh, microwave, cupboards all the way around storage underneath those, there's a storage um, cupboard there and then it also has a shower and a toilet so there's a toilet there, shower curtain and the shower comes out from there but we'll probably use, we will use it but we'll use ones on site as well um, so she's taking measurements to know what bedding is yeah. there because you get the mattress protector on this one but you don't get it with these so when we're parked up That'll be the girls and my sister's area all down there. It's not baking in here. No, it's not actually today. And there's no windows open, so if the windows were open, it'd be a lot better. So that converts into a, sleep, a big, big bed, um, if if need be. Um, and then that'll be our area. It's just a shame there's no like yeah. pull across curtain, but we'll be fine. It it'll be here. yeah, it'll be an adventure and it'll be fine. I think all these have, <laughs> <trying to> convince <laughs> yourself. they all have um, fly screens, which is th that's exactly what we needed at the lodge, actually. Just that techno it, that's what you needed to make. So um, yeah, all sorted. Got those measurements. So we're just looking at what we get with the other oh, kettle. Yeah, yeah that's what kettle. my main thing was. So kettle, cutlery drawer. Pots and pans. Um, pots and pans down there. In these cupboards up here, we get all as um, wine glasses. That's very important. Plastic wine glasses. That's these good. plastic. Yeah, yeah they are. Yeah, like good. Mine. Good. And then your, your fridge here 
is powered by gas, solar or electric. So right. even when you're driving it, you can run on gas, which is a bit weird. So back here, is this our only, um, what's that? Oh, that's light. light. So we've got just one plug back here. Uh, yes, no, there's one there. I'm excited. I can't actually wait now to get in it. This is your central heating, look. Where? There. Well, hopefully we won't need that. And under here is basically what they call the garage. Yeah. So that's where all the... Oh, God, it's not massive. We're definitely going to fill that. Two t-shirts, one for one week, one for another week. Ugh. We'll be sorted. Nick's just about to open a bottle of Prosecco. <laughs> it's one of those unexpected um, afternoons where we're sat with our friends. And um, she just she brought all the Prosecco so out of a bag. We're not going to say no. We're rude to say no. Well, we can't in the calories, so... a little drink with um, our friend Elaine there. Nick's cracking on with that. Oh, I take a screwdriver, please. Is there any up there? No. Nick's cracking on with that. I'm going to show you some new teas that I bought at Morrison's. Oh, interesting. So last week I got all excited about that Nespresso machine in the Airbnbs, and I really wanted uh, a coffee machine. This week, as I always do, I like to change my mind. I am trying to cut back on my caffeine intake. So, it's just what I do, I change my mind and stuff. Um, and I have got some, what's these? Oh, that's one it got, sour cream and chive thins. I got three packets of caffeine free tea, which I'm gonna start drinking more of. I just wanna start deep, uh, hydrating myself more. I don't drink enough water, so I'm just trying to, I do like a hot drink though. So I'm just gonna try and get it that way. So I got some um, Morrison's, what's these? Sweet Dreams, unwind with a mellow soothing blend of chamomile with apple and warming spices. Peppermint Paradise, those were two for two pounds. And I really like this Twinings Lemon and Ginger. They're all caffeine free. So apparently I'm needed. What do you want? You've done it. So Nick's putting these brackets on, which will keep it Nick's trying. held down once we shut it, and then you've just got to put the stuff on there, It took me you? ages to find out what these things were called. They're called side, hook, and eye. Then you've just got to put the mesh on. Well. And we're sorted. Wait a minute. Oh, you are kidding me. Oh, don't tell me. Is it a gap? Yeah. A spider could get down there. What? Easy. Oh, no. You got to you know, put it on right. Mesh going on. I'm looking forward to wind dropping tonight. Me too. Well, we can just leave it all open all day and let air through. Well, yeah. I've just got, this is like the critical bit now, because I've got to get this on without any ripples, and it's got to be stretched. So, this is like the first attempt. And I'm going to make a cup of tea. Oh, nice. Just a few touch-ups, and we're done. It's perfect. The mesh is on. The uh, latches are keeping it nice and secure. It's still red on here, though. <laughs> But right, done. I'm amazed with that. Very impressed. You know what we do need now though? One on there, so that on an evening you can have the air blow, air flow flowing through. You can frig off. Why? You like doing stuff like that? I don't like that. I must say I'm very impressed with that. Though. You can't even tell, can you? Mm. Well, I mean, most of these blobs are dry. You yeah. can't even see that, I mean, it's pretty stretched down tight that. It's like a lanai on a Florida swimming pool and the air can flow. Actually, I can't feel a thing. Well, there's just no way, there's no reason <laughs> <in> it. <laughs> Very exciting stuff. I've just had a little tidy out of my uh, coffee and tea cupboard. It's now mainly teas. What do you want? Um, Peppermint paradise. Um, Be good for your stomach. Yeah, but it's a bit warm for something like that. Well, well, they always do say that a warm drink cools your body temperature down. What about an iced peppermint tea? Well, actually, there is these things. Cold infused for water bottles, passion fruit, mango, and orange. Sugar free, I presume, the caffeine free. Uh, drop one of our little infusion bags into your water bottle. Wait five minutes and watch it swirl. Don't forget to shake it. La la la. Glass of water with ice. One a minute. Thank you. We don't have any ice, I'm afraid. We're all out of ice. Oh. But you do, I don't know, well, 
have a look. Just surprise me. Drop it in. It's supposed to be in a water bottle, but obviously we don't have any water bottles. Well, I do, but I'm putting it in a glass. Let me get a spoon. Right, my chores are done for today. Well, here's a cup of nice cold tea. Leave it five minutes and that'll be ready. And that is, if you didn't see, I think my mum got me this for my birthday last year. I haven't even used it yet, or, or Christmas. It's called Infuse Twinings. Um, Passion fruit, mango, and orange. It's going a bit orangey colored. I think this might be cheating. I know we have no ice, so I, but I remember we've got some orange ice pops. So, um, is that bag disintegrated or is it two bags? Is it? No, it's two bags. All oh, right, okay. So, um, there you go. Oh, Enjoy it's your... so warm in the lodge. Ow, that's hot as hell. Water. Enjoy your iced tea. Have a try of it. <laughs> See what it's like. All I mean, right, it's, it's, it's not quite ready yet. You're supposed to leave it for five minutes. Oh, it smells very um, passion fruity. Tastes nothing. It smells fruity, but tastes of nothing. It's good for your hydration levels. Chicken salad and a pizza. That's for tea. What are you moaning at? I'm gonna put, the thing is, if we have this tomorrow night with the chorizo and potatoes, they'll be extra. So I might as well just cut a slither off and just a bitty, bitty, bitty. What Nick's on about is I thought we were having something completely different for um, evening meal. I found that in the fridge. I have no idea where we got it from or how long we've had it, but it's sealed. Yeah, and, um, so you can't find Ooh. Where did we get that from? Them? I have no idea, but it's been in the fridge for. This was some um, farm shop. Uh, this is beautiful. Uh, juniper and black pepper beetroot from Mori Bobbins, and we're having jalapeno pineapple and kale pizza from Muscle Food. So Nick has just spent an hour sort of chilling in the bedroom under the windows with them open. How's it been? Oh my god, I can't describe it. Five years it took to do that. Now I have been teasing everybody on Facebook, so there's been a lot of people. Trying to guess what I've been making. We've had things like you're making a new door, you're making a bar for outside. Some mm, people said a coffee. That's a good idea. Um, people, I mean, a lot of people have actually guessed and got it right, but it's not actually a fly screen, it's a spider screen. That's true. Although flies are a pain in the ass here as well. We, we don't tend to get many in the bedroom, but it's mainly spiders coming in and crawling on his faces. Twice it's happened in five years, and it happened no longer. Would you like to close the oven? Can you oh, not yeah. put that in the air fryer while it's not fit? Nah, it's too big, I think. You could cut it in half. Nah. Cut it in half, no, put it in the air fryer, it'll be done in five minutes. Oh, for freak's sakes. I like to use the air fryer. We've never used it for anything like this before, like a pizza or, well, it is a pizza. This will be fun. So we're gonna cut it in half, and then put it in the air fryer. Shall I turn this off now? Yeah. Nick um, always uses the oven and leaves all the trays in, which um, annoys me. Yeah, it sterilizes them. Eh? Never put a pizza. Where's well, this thingy? Do we need to put a thingy in? There's lime. Uh, we don't have to, no. Not for this, but I will do. Say so it's clean, it, doesn't it? Mind so you, it's, it's, gone, it's not going to drip any fat or all, is it? No, so it's just pizza. It might be crumbs, but you're still going to have to kind of wash it out. So how's this going to work? Then? Oh, no. I put oven back on. Is that what you planned? <laughs> well, no, no, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Don't give up at the first hurdle. Ta-da! Sure? Yeah, it'll be fine. You think it'll collapse? Uh, no, because it'll crisp, and if it does collapse, it'll just be bent pizza. Let well, me just wedge it in. Oh no, put that in the oven. Do the Vivera chicken in there instead. No, 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 because that can't be roasted. <laughs> this is looking nice. Vivera chicken breast, the most amazing fake chicken I've ever tasted. Yeah, it is good fake chicken. It tastes, well, tastes like chicken. chicken. It tastes what like are you texting? It tastes like, um, I'm just messaging our friend Gemma, I'm just sending her some recipe ideas. Just um, explaining what Vivera chicken breasts are. Can I have a look at this yet? Uh, yes, you can. Ooh! Well, is it ready? Almost. It needs a bit, a bit browning more. Ooh. I keep going into the bedroom and having a look at my fly screen. I'm so impressed with it. At least, at least not suppressed. Not so impressed. Okay. You'll be in. What? Huh? You'll be impressed tonight when you're seeing the benefit of it and it's nice and cool blowing on you without the risk of spiders running over your face. I've just had a nice pop. Yeah, we can see. So we have a Zoom call at, what time? Uh, 15 minutes at 8pm. 8 o'clock. Um, we have a party night that we've got <coughs> planned with our community members. Um, I'm what? Down I'm down here. Party night planned with our community members. It's a 1980s party night so yep. next week at some point I need to go clothes shopping for something retro because a lot just of people... Just get your smart, just get your Stranger Things t-shirt out, that'd be fine. 
Oh, that's a bit boring. Well, what's the point in wasting money for one night? It's 80s. Well, let's just have a look for like a shirt that Mark would wear and then I'm fine. Well, like the one he got you're in, not going to get that from Prime, are you? In Florida. Sure. Um, so. I've just had a nectarine and it's made my lips sore. Does anybody else who eats nectarines and tomatoes, like fresh tomatoes, lips go sore when they've eaten them? I always get that. Every time I have nectarines, they feel like, like they're throbbing. I'm not keen on nectarines, so I wouldn't know. Nick likes them when they're like apples crunchy. <sighs> oh, I do, yeah. Um, I'm currently chatting to Virgin. I've not given up trying to get my mum an upgrade. Um, or even just like paying for a normal upgrade because she's currently, my brother, as we've said previously, my brother has booked her on the flight through his American Express card through Delta, um, but she's on the same flight as us. So we're having I to can't upgrade up, I can't upgrade her with my points. I can't change her booking because my we, brother's booked it. We can't pay for it because it's not our booking. Well, so. I'm trying to, I'm trying to Virgin. Well, I'm hopefully trying just trying to get a cost, how much it's going to cost me to upgrade it from economy to premium. There's only four seats left Can and there's no reward this? seats available as well. This is just the book comes with Well, and put that on then. Can you remember? Well, that's when you wear that costume. Because it's not 80s, that's Halloween. It'll do. It's Rocky Horror, innit? Yeah. Right, I'm going to chat to Virgin and then we're going to do this Zoom call. We're just having our Zoom call about the 1980s weekend, but Nick's currently um, telling everybody about his fly screen that he made. Well, he's just updating the blog. I'm just telling, <laughs> telling you, telling the blog about me telling you about my fly screen. He's also got a gin. So we're just going to go and discuss like where we're getting our 1980s um, outfits from, things like that, and then um, right, we're starting. I'm going to make a cup of tea then. Right, we're done on a Zoom call. Just making a Morrison Sweet Dream chamomile tea, and going to do some uh, toast, and going to put on what I got today. Nick's just doing some over there. Um, to do with the our Zoom call at 1980s weekend. Anyway, I'm going to have this Meridian crunchy peanut butter. It's usually very nice as Meridian. Let me just stop this toast from burning. Right, it's time for bed. I put the lights on. It's really cool in here now, which is amazing. And this is quite springy. And um, we've put the lights on. So any flies that come in now will kind of hit the back of the screen and they won't get in. There's literally no gap here now. Nothing can get through. Have to pull the curtains down though, won't you? Are you naked? Ready for bed. <laughs> um, oh yeah, I've got to get the curtains down, otherwise it's going to be light. Yeah. Well, that's going to block the air. Well, no, not really. I uh -huh. I never thought of that. Good morning, guys. It's the next day. It worked a treat. I slept um, all the way through. <laughs> I had this update planned. I've just been editing this vlog and realised we hadn't actually finished it, even though we've actually started another one, which you will have seen after this one. So the verdict, basically, I forgot to tell you guys last night what happened with Virgin. So I chatted with them um, and said... Oh, about Nick's mum's flight. Yeah, so I was chatting with them just before the Zoom call. And basically, I said, well, how much is it going to cost to go from economy to premium? I don't even know the outcome if I pay If I pay cash. Uh, and the guy just says, you'll need to speak to Amex Travel, which is who my brother booked it through. So Lee sent him a WhatsApp and just said, brother a get a price, see how much it's going to cost. So you can get a price. So um, just or just upgrade it, whichever. So that's basically, she's basically sat in economy at the minute and there's nothing we can do. We might be able to do something at the airport, but anyway, fly screen. Spider oh screen. my God. I got into bed last night, I was like, oh, it's been nippy actually. It was morning, it was cold. <laughs> Today's um, going to be like 29 degrees and... No, it's not. Or 27. It's 29, 27 at the apartment and 21 here. Tomorrow it's going to be 27 here and 29 at the apartment. So tomorrow we are really going to see the benefit of it. But we had no spiders, no flies, and nothing on the inside of the mesh either. I just slept all the way through and it was just one of those nice... It, it was a cooling sleep. Was a cool, yeah, like just a nice fresh air sleep. Where we lived in the old house, we used to have the ensuite bedroom, the ensuite window open every night and it always used to keep the air recycled. Here we can't do it because of spiders, flies, mosquitoes, whatever. Um, but now we can. It's like a new lodge. I was just saying, um, I don't know whether we, um, <clears throat> I I've mentioned it in the uh, vlog, you'll be able to tell me. Obviously you saw that we went to the lounge, which is an on-site um, place where we go for a chill and a coffee on the, on the lodge pack. And um, our friend Elaine, who you've seen on the vlog many times, she just came in, sort of like, oh, can I come and join you for a cup, cup of tea? No plans, no to sit with. And we're like, yeah, yeah, come over. But she brought cheese, <laughs> she crackers, had a bag, and wine. She's like, well, do you want, a, do you want some Prosecco? I'm like, all right. So she produced a 
the bottle of Prosecco. It was like Carmine Granger's bag where she pulls the tent out, wasn't it? It was and then a she tiny little like, handbag and it just popped out. And then we'd, we'd had a couple of um, glasses of Prosecco and she'd, she'd put the strawberries in and uh, we were catching up. We'd not seen her for a while. And then she says, well, I've got some nibbling bits if you want some. So she, she produced ham on um, Cocktail sticks, sticks. Uh, cheese, um, some fruit, some crackers. Then out <laughs> then out came a box of ice, uh, yeah. and then a gin, and then tonic. And we were like, no, no, we've, no gin, we've, had, we we've had, had a couple of glasses of Prosecco. So we had some Prosecco and some ham and cheese, which were beautiful. And we're just, um, we're just talking to somebody about it, saying everybody needs a friend like that, don't they? That just produces a full picnic from the bag. Just, she just took it just I don't know case. how she does it. I don't know how she does it. But so, literally, the bag is like the tiniest bag. It's like a little slip purse, and yet pulls out a bottle of wine. Yeah. So. Right, finish the vlog. Thanks for watching today, guys. Hit the like button, click the notification bell, drop us a comment below. Um, it's another beautiful day today. Um, um, I've got some um, tidying up to do outside because there's loads of bird crap and weeds everywhere. And the rabbits have been scratching the um, mulch. We so have I'm friends going to sweep coming it all tomorrow. So we have to go out and get some nibbles and stuff today. Tomorrow. Or maybe we'll just do it tomorrow. Tomorrow. Okay. Bye, see you on the next vlog. Bye.